So a surface constraint is a procedural version of Modo's background constraint. And this will conform a piece of geometry to another piece of geometry in the scene. With it now being procedural, it means we can also rig and animate those qualities. So in this scene, I have some text that I've defined, and I want to stick that text onto the bottom of this bottle. So if I add a surface constraint, a dialog will come up. First of all, I need to define the object that I want it to stick to. In this case, it's the bottle. And then I need to choose the mode, and I'm going to choose directional. So this will move the geometry along a particular axis that I define and until it hits that object. So if I hit OK, that geometry will conform and stick to that surface. And with it there, I can then apply additional mesh operations to create the geometry that I need. But what's great about this, because it's procedural, is I can go back to the base mesh if I want and make an edit and everything's going to update.